Hey there YouTube, BadVapBandy here, and I have a new match for you guys. If you couldn't tell already, it is a firing range classic team deathmatch. Um, this is Bare Bones. I've been liking this playlist a bit uh, more because, well, really, I uh, there are two reasons I generally don't play team deathmatch. Uh, one is for the silencers, and the other is for the, well, silencers and camping sort of go hand in hand. Uh, it's nice to use a silencer when you flank enemy position, but uh, otherwise it is a uh, tool for camper's destruction. And the other is uh, the Claymore, and uh, this sort of eliminates both of them. Uh, you always have the radar on, there's no counter UAV, and uh, there is no Claymores, so I don't know. It's It's been really fun for me uh, since I started playing it. And yeah, so this is a game of, uh, I, I had uh, my general team deathmatch strategy is just running from spawn to spawn as they will change quite consistently. And uh, here you see that. Uh, the kill streaks are also uh, 3, 5, 7, uh, Napalm Spray and Attack Helicopter, and that is pretty much standard. Uh, you always have to have it whenever you play uh, play this Bare Bones Classic Team Deathmatch. I really like what they did, uh, to be honest, what Treyarch did. And they took the Bare Bones idea from Modern Warfare 2 that they sort of half-assed, and Infinity Ward sort of half-assed for the end of the, end of the um, reign of Modern Warfare 2, and brought it into this whole, like, Bare Bones Pure is completely stripped uh, from anything. I don't like necessarily the fact that it's just TDM, um, but I really like the the way that they, they went about that. So I'm using the Galil. I had the uh, Galil Brutality, I think it was, challenge when this was going on, um, but this is pretty much just a regular commentary. I decided to halt briefly, um, until Tuesday, <laughs> the uh, Christmas Loop Chronicles, because I, I wanted to get a commentary out for you guys. It uh, hasn't been in a while. And, yeah, so this is, I was debating whether or not to post this match, but something happens toward the end that was kind of, like, fallen, uh, so I decided to, uh, decided to put it up there. Mm, I don't know, is Ballin still used in the, just, general idiom? Um, I don't, I don't follow that thing, those, those, uh, those phrases much. But, that was all the rage, like, two years ago. <laughs> two, three years ago. Um, so you see here, they weren't the greatest team ever on the uh, opposing team. I think our guys were, were quite uh, terrible too, as I get destroyed by some guy there, and uh, that makes me sad because I didn't realize they were spawning there anymore. Um, Ghost is always pretty much for this game type because UAV is constant uh, for both teams, and uh, three kill streakers, it really isn't that hard to get. Uh, but you do have perks, and I do think I actually cited him pro for this, uh, which is nice. I find that I usually get that, and I usually get hardline if I ever try for the pro perks first. Um, but yeah, so that's pretty much it. As far as New Year's, Happy New Year's, guys. I uh, hope that everyone enjoyed uh, 2010 and is welcoming it out or saying goodbye to it or something of the sort. I guess you can't really welcome something out. Uh, you could, I don't know. I don't know how to phrase that. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, as far as New, New Year's resolutions go, I don't really have uh, many sort of like one and done. I'm not doing this anymore. I'm not doing that anymore. Really nothing to quit. Um, I'd just like to uh, continue with everything that I'm doing and trying to get good content out there for you guys. And uh, maybe maybe stop the uh, stop the rage at the video games in general. Um, that is sort of... But there, there are so many things in random games that uh, do do that. And uh, I actually ran into a lag switcher the other day. <laughs> and it was the first one on Black Ops uh, that I've faced. And uh, that was that was a fun lobby. Um, and it, was, it wasn't even the lag switch. It was the lag switch and the fact that every single... But it was a party, and one guy was lag switching, and they all had FAL mods, and uh, that was that was kind of fun. It was also the first modern lobby that I ran into, so uh, that's pretty much that. But this game has been really fun for me. Uh, Black Ops is quite entertaining. They had their spurts of I thought that was an enemy because why else would you be going down there? I guess you saw the red dots, and I didn't, and that is why I'm bad at this game. But uh, this is actually the moment of truth that I decided to. Decided to upload that because that's just fucking that's awesome, right there. If you if you excuse me saying it because I did it, um, but who gets a double python spray at long range? Um, that was the first time I've done that, so I was I was kind of happy. But that's pretty much it. Love the python for a secondary uh, with assault rifles. You really need that extra little burst. But as I'm closing this out, I would like to instill a news resolution into you guys. Uh, like or dislike the video. Uh, it really helps out commentators and anybody in general, any YouTube video you watch, uh, because it, it allows feedback that you get from the viewers as you would or would not get in comment section. And uh, I would like to sort of one-up that and a little bit on my end. And I would say that if this video gets 1,000 likes uh, within the first week, 
I will upload a video uh, to my channel of me running around the block with my shirt off in sub-freezing temperatures. And if I meet anybody on the way, I have to do my YouTube intro and keep going. So that's pretty much it. And if you guys liked it, like it. If you didn't, dislike it. There we go. Peace out. Hope you enjoy.